Good morning everybody and welcome back to another video. Today is Saturday, February 13th. It is our first day of projects for our new house. So I wanted to take you guys along to show you what we're doing today. Um, it is about 9.45 in the morning, so I've been up for a little bit, but my fiance George has finally gotten up. He's showering, we're getting ready to go. Plan for today is to actually start painting. So we are going to head out to the store in a little bit, either Home Depot or Lowe's to gather our paints. We have some colors picked out. Um, I got a bunch of the supplies yesterday from Walmart, so that's already done. I think we're going to start two rooms today. We have two rooms that we want to change the color completely. The rest of the house we actually really, really like, at least for now, um, but it does need some touching up. So luckily the sellers did leave some touch up paint, so we might start that today, kind of depending on how much time we have. The colors that we're repainting, I'll show you, are very, very dark. So it's going to take a couple of coats, so maybe in between coats we can do some touch up stuff. But we're going to go ahead and have a day full of painting. So we just got our paint. Um, we are getting ready to leave. I'm waiting for George to come back out from the store he's getting a carpet cleaner you know like a shampooer because there are a couple stains that we want to try to get out so before we get furniture in there we're going to try to do that i just loaded the car with the paint and the extra supplies that we needed um we're ready to go paint the colors we picked out were from lowe's but we ended up actually just coming to walmart and just finding dupes for them so we picked some pretty similar colors so we're very excited about them so i'll show you the colors when we get to the house so here's our before so we have country white for these three walls this green color for this wall. Ready? take a lunch break we're starving it's probably close to two right now but I do want to show you the progress I have so far I have two and a half walls done I would say on the second coat of the primer so we knew it was gonna take a lot of paint we knew it was gonna take a little while but we're very happy with what it looks like so far so this wall's done this one has a second coat and you can see that I started down here <laughs> is done it definitely is gonna need at least another coat but we only have one gallon of that paint I don't know where it is we only had one gallon of that paint because that's all that they had at the store so we'll do what we can today to finish it we can definitely get another coat on here with the gallon but we're gonna probably have to get another one but these three walls have their coat on it and I'm about to start this wall with the green but this is the end of day one we are about to film it's <laughs> late now um, but we ended up putting two coats of the white on this wall this wall got part of a second coat but we ran out of paint so we have to come back we're gonna try another Walmart tomorrow and see if they have more but the green wall needs another coat as well but that should probably only take two but it's looking really good so we're gonna come back tomorrow and finish 
So I just made it to the house. I beat George here actually, so he should be coming in just a minute now. He stopped at Duncan, but I found the goods. They had one can left. This must be a very popular color. So I got the last can, and let me show you what the room looks like from yesterday. So here's what it looks like now dried from yesterday. So you can see that there are still a few spots here on the green. We're gonna do another coat for sure. Um, plenty of that paint left. And then this is what the white looks like. You can kind of tell that it's a little splotchy. So hopefully one more coat should be enough. These two walls already had two coats on it. This wall, you can see it's even more splotchier. We ran out of paint, so we have to finish the second coat over here, and then we'll come back and do a third coat as well. So hopefully that's all that it takes, but I think it looks really good. And then we are gonna touch up the trim. We are gonna keep this like bright white color for the trim and the doors, but the trim like had some stains and stuff on it, so we are gonna touch that up too. So we haven't been super careful with like taping and things because we're gonna paint over it anyway. Yeah, that's what it looks like. I love the colors together. now we are getting ready to wrap up for the day George is finishing up one of the bathrooms and I'm gonna show you what we've done in the bedroom and how it looks we did a lot of cleaning today just like scrubbing walls and touching up some paint we had a little mishap let me show you so the sellers were so nice to leave these nicely labeled jars of paint for all of the rooms um, but this one did not have a label on it and we thought that it was for the gray and so when we started touching up the gray paint we quickly realized well, not quickly, obviously, because we did all of that and this and this, and it did not dry the same color. So, so this room <laughs> will probably have to be repainted, which isn't a big deal. We liked the gray um, and we'll probably paint it gray again, but there's just so much like touch up these spots. And also um, I touched up some other spots and they're not drying very nicely. Like you can kind of see them here. And I mean, it's been a couple hours now since they've started drying or since I did them. So all over the house, this color, I think it just doesn't look very nice. So we'll see if it gets better the next time we come back. But um, right now, I'm not super thrilled. But this is how the bedroom looks right now. It's still drying, so it does look a little splotchy on the green. There are probably gonna be some spots. We might have to do a second or a third coat. Um, the bottom looks a little bit lighter than the top. So might have to do a third coat, but not a big deal. Overall though, you can kind of see what it's going to look like. We do have to do the trim. We did want to redo the trim, so we didn't tape up there, but I love the colors I think they look so nice together and it's exactly what I wanted just much brighter and a fun color accent wall George also took these down some of the vents so I could clean them and oh my gosh it's like night and day they were yellow and literally disgusting this one I couldn't get as well but you can see it's a little bit rusted but these were just dirty so those will have to go back up on the ceiling and then ones from the bathroom but i'm so happy that they cleaned up so well so i'm gonna go ahead and end this video here george is finishing up the other bathroom but my camera is close to dying so i wanted to be able to finish this video before it dies and i will definitely show you guys the bathroom in another upcoming video so thank you guys so much for watching we had so much fun doing our first product in our new home and there'll be plenty more to come so i will see you guys in the next video bye